Oh, why, Webb? It is once again I, your buddy, Knox Burzum, back to bring you more blasphemous brews. Today, we have Three Sheeps Brewing Rebel Kent Amber Ale. Nice looking little bottle here, pretty much handheld. Nice little uh, logo on the top. Gonna have this with some tacos this morning for my uh, breakfast slash brunch, because, you know, normal people don't eat brunch at 3 o'clock in the afternoon, but I do, because that's how I roll. Uh, let's see here. No real information on it. Touch of sweet, malty, daily drinker. Well, I am a daily drinker. So, let's go ahead and give this shit a try, shall we? This is another one of those bottles I got from uh, Woodman's, of course. Woodman's being the best place in northern Wisconsin, as far as I am concerned, to get your alcohol from. Smells pretty, smell, has a deep, rich aroma. This gorgeous, deep amber coloration. It's a little bit like some sort of nutty tea, actually. It's kind of sweet. Does actually taste a little bit nutty. That is very malty, it is very sweet, it's very rich. Like, very rich. It has almost a buttery consistency to it. It's actually quite amazing. This stuff is delicious. Rebel Kent, no, no, Rebel Kent Amber Ale. So if it's about a dollar fifty, maybe two bucks a bottle at Woodman's, I highly suggest you pick it up. Oh my god. This would go amazing with a cheeseburger with some really sharp cheddar on it. This is gonna go great with tacos, which is what I'm about to have with it. And uh ribs. Ribs would be amazing with this shit. Barbecued ribs. So I know this is short, but there's not much to say about it. Three Sheeps Brewing, Rebel Kent, Amber Ale. Go and pick yourselves some up today. Keep on drinking. Keep on being metal. Knoxburgism, signing off.